Hi friends, I'm making the most hyped Netflix series inspired fried dim sum by Queen of Chinese Cooking. Mince around 250 to 300 grams of fresh prawns like this. Chef's dim sum recipe had lotus fruit in it. However, we'll be skipping it and adding our favorite choice of mushroom. Finely chopped mushroom as shown. To the minced shrimp, add mushrooms, spring onion greens, some garlic, 1 tablespoon of soy sauce, 1 teaspoon of oil, sesame oil, some salt, some black pepper powder. I have added half an egg for some binding. Give it a slight mix. Add 1 to 1.5 tablespoon of corn flour and keep it in refrigerator for some time for it to thicken up. Here comes the most toughest part. Chef in the Netflix series had uh, finely chopped the spring roll pastry sheets. She had rolled it up and she had finely chopped it. However, me not being a chef, I had to find another way to do it successfully. Each spring roll sheet was moving in different different direction. It was so difficult to hold it tightly and chop it. It was super slippery. After a couple of attempts of chopping with knife, I gave up on this idea. I couldn't achieve thin strips just like chef. I figured a way out and I used my scissors, chopped some very thin slices, manually separated each strip. I feel this recipe requires a lot of patience while especially when you chop these strips. However, when you're going to taste the end result, you're not going to have any regrets. I'm taking out the refrigerated shrimp paste. I mean the shrimp mushroom paste. Place it on the bed of spring roll strips. Secure it something like this and make some balls. When you're going to deep fry it, it's going to turn out really golden, pretty and very crispy. This is a shortcut mala cream sauce. Take some cooking cream or mayonnaise and add some chili oil to it and give it a good mix. The recipe requires straining of the sauce. However, I skipped the same. It's ready to be deep fried. Gently place it in the hot oil and fry it on medium to high flame. Fry both the sides well. Pretty and thin strips of spring roll sheets are clearly visible and it's looking so satisfying. Place it over the dollops of the mala cream sauce. I have topped it with some very thinly chopped spring onion greens and Thai red chilies. So what are you waiting for? Try the Culinary Class Wars winning fried dim sum dish. Don't forget to like and subscribe.